closed. You don't look the sort who can afford to turn down legitimate work. <coughs> what do you want? How about we start with a light? Elizabeth. You can call me Elizabeth. What can I do for you? There's a girl who needs to be found. Maybe you've seen her. This girl. This girl's dead. You know her. You'll see dozens of her type down by the docks or the slums in Apollo Square. Orphans. With Fontaine's charity shut. No place for them. But her you know. As I said, the girl's dead. Lost. Look, I don't know where you get... Lost it. isn't dead. Name your radar will pay you for this work. But you do this one gratis, wouldn't you? I don't follow. Something tells me you will. Seems my instincts were correct. Where's Sally? I don't know. But I know someone who does. Follow me. What's this girl to you? What I need from her is my business. And I know where to start. Something tells me a man with your particular talents could be useful. About your little friend. Such a... What happened to these children? What are they? Where have you been? Cabin in Arcadia? Little sisters. Atom factories. It's grotesque. Red means stop, green means go. This is the rule all little girls know. Compromise? Is that why we came to Rapture? I could compromise in Red Hook. We're just men and women, Alan. You hold yourself to that standard, you'll never be happy. In what country is there a place for men like me? Men who refuse to say yes to the doubters. not knowing about the little sisters. How long have you been in Rapture? Well, let's just say I don't get out much. You've got eyes and ears, don't you? If I wanted to share my life story, Mr. DeWitt, I would write my memoirs. If I learned anything about Rapture, I thought it was a place where people understood to mind their own business. Where are we headed? The man we need to see is in the Garden of the Muses. How do you know? My sources are my own, Mr. DeWitt. If you have better information as to the whereabouts of your girl, I suggest you avail yourself of it. Taking me. When's the last time you saw Sally? What? She was taken from you, wasn't she? How do you know this? She was taken, down at Surprise. You were playing the tables and... She disappeared. And? Cop friend of mine, Sullivan, says they found her floating in the docks. You see the body? Look. Did you see the body? This world values children, not childhood. There's a profit to be made and men who make it. I'm taking you to one of them. Mr. DeWitt, you all right? I'm fine. Just get these spells sometimes. It'll pass. 
Refreshment, sir. Madam? We're fine, thanks. I went through basic. I told her. Mr. DeWitt. We'll find my source inside of that club. Cohen? What does that lunatic have to do with Sally? Private party. No entry without invitation. We'll see about that. Which business do you represent, sir? Uh, business? Yes, which business? DeWitt Investigations. Mr. Cohen does not truck with private detectives. Masks of invitation went to artists and craftsmen alone. I'm with the artist struggle. We're expected... No mask, no entry. Stuffed shirt. These invitation masks he spoke of, they must have gone out to local artisans. Well, I guess we'll have to persuade someone to loan us one. The business of Rapture is business. It says it's sponsored by the artist struggle, the Golden Rule, and Rapture Records. I guess those stores would be as good a place to start as any. you to rapture a man really you don't strike me as the romantic type wasn't that kind of man then what there's a debt that needs repaying i've known my share of shylocks you're no shylock wasn't that kind of debt Invitations to Cohen shows are highly coveted. Nobody's gonna just hand us one. You think you can figure out a way to distract the store owner while I take a look around? You just find the mask. Leave the distractions to me. A fine day to you both. Excuse me. Lady has some questions for you. Yes, of course. I'm interested in this piece. Ah, excellent. It's a natural sapphire and diamond, 18 karat gold ring, fully hallmarked for Paris, 1887. That's a lot of fine talk about a stolen ring. I beg your pardon? Right out of her coffin in Twilight Fields. Did you think we wouldn't notice? Cohen sends those masks out in some kind of box. Bring back the matter will remain between you and me. Damn. Must be somewhere else. I don't think so. Hit the bricks, you tramp! What? Get your hands off me! if we were gone when he wakes up. Any luck? Nothing. Let's find another shop. Where should we look next? Upstairs at the artist's struggle or rapture records straight ahead? Are you in the know? The Big Daddy may look imposing, but he's a gentle giant. Do you know all he does for Rapture? These metal jets are the hands that maintain Rapture, digging the foundation out of the seabed and guiding structural supports into place. Where do these metal mysteries come from? 
Sorry, chum. That's a Ryan Industries trade secret. Now you know. Whatever that barber did to you, I hope he's retained a capable attorney. Should we have to feed them? Isn't a prisoner just another parasite? Tip. I don't think these supermen know the meaning of the word. I had all of these visions before coming down here of Utopia. Every man with his hand on the great chain, the wheel of progress turning. Every cliche you can imagine. And what is the first thing that happens when I open a shop? Petty thievery. Now I have to lock all my valuables in the closet. Remember 2076. It's the problem with coming to Utopia. Is that it still has the people. Fontaine's people were treated. visions before coming down here of utopia every man with his hand on the great chain the wheel of progress turning every cliche you can imagine and what is the first thing that happens when i open up shop petty thievery now i have to lock all my valuables in the closet remember 2076 it's the problem with coming to utopia is that it still has the people
When Ryan take over Fontaine Futuristics, scene of a terrible violence. Splices burning each other to bits. Lucky ones not killed, sent to department to stop prison instead. Suchon think he dead man too. But then, Ryan comes to Suchong and says, Su Chung want to be buried in filthy store, or Su Chung want to make a good salary? Work for Ryan. How much salary? asks Su Chung. This Ryan find very funny. This clown bothering you. The Great Chain Guides. Gets that from his father. No one from my side of the family was ever so. Guten Tag, Herr Schmidt. Italian and so soon. Keep it down, Fee, right? About the dispersions being made about me, huh? This legal nonsense, right? About what Ryan wants. This society of a lord. Are you in the know? Innovation and competition are what fuel rapture. But that fuel can be diluted with rumor or flat-out lies. The rumor monger asks, what are these so-called splicing side effects? Well, take a look around you. Do you see anything wrong with your neighbor? The rumor monger asks, why has Tenenbaum withdrawn from the public's eye? Dr. Tenenbaum is a scientific mind unparalleled, even in Rapture. She's no doubt in her lab, toiling away at her next great innovation. I heard she was in cahoots with Fontaine. Merely slander from jealous naysayers. Remember, Rapture competes through innovation, not cheap shots. Bridget Tenenbaum is a woman who represents the best of science and industry. In other words, She's a rupture gal. Now you know. How am I going to get work? Post it up like. <laughs> Wonderful to see you. You see that dish I walked in with? Will you give her the star treatment, pal? Then I'll make it worth your while. But of course, right away. Interesting, isn't it? An original Sander Cohen. He calls it... My I'm sorry, but I, I know precious little about art. Gotta find that box. I don't know. Nothing. Oh, only one place left. Would you like me to tell you what it means? Oh, would you? Oh, I would like so much to make that. In this, Cohen intended to show us the struggle of the great man. Breathe the swampy air of the parasite. <laughs> you see all that in that little picture? Yes. In fact, it, it, um, your companion goes... 
Oh, what's this one? Oh, please, it's so beautiful. What does it mean? You've given me so much to think about. I, I feel a trifle swoony. W would you mind if, if I return tomorrow for further education? I shall be here at your service. Until tomorrow. One place left, though. And if that proves to be fruitless, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Are you in the know? You've doubtlessly sampled products from Fontaine Futuristics. But do you know why Ryan Industries saved it? Frank Fontaine, business leader and benefactor of mankind? Or was he the best friend the parasite ever had? Were you aware his businesses were a front for a smuggling ring? And were you also fooled by his supposed charity work? At his free clinic, patients became test subjects and his orphanages were places that children disappeared into and never came out. Once they learned the truth, Rapture's Central Council called for the arrest of Fontaine Futuristic's owner. But, a coward to the end, Fontaine found a hail of bullets preferable to facing justice. The Council asked that Ryan Industries assume the burden of stewardship of Fontaine's ill-gotten assets. And Andrew Ryan accepted that burden for the people of Rapture. Now all citizens can enjoy these products, free of criminal taint. Now you know. Fontaine got taken up by Ryan. observe strangest of coincidences. On other side of a window, man in strange hat experimenting on Su Chung's own creation. On plasmid. Man name of Fink. Outrage! Death of intellectual property! <sighs> but man name of Fink is no fool. Through addition of oxidizing agent, turns plasmid ingestible through stomach lining. Mr. Ryan very impressed with Su Chong's initiative. Theft of intellectual property, two-way street. Steinman told me he Well, hello. Pal, you want to help out the little lady? Yes, of course. What is this piece? 
It's five. Where is he hiding that box? Located the mask. Third time's a charm. All right. It's best we head back to Cohen's. Fine piece of work back with those shopkeeps. You've got a bit of the grifter in you. For that, you can thank my father. Oh, yeah? He was a man comfortable in a variety of roles. Well, I'm not looking to be an obstacle to your accomplishments. field you in? Field? Yeah, you know, occupation. Can't imagine what kind of employment would lead you to tag along on a job like this. Suppose you could say I work in debt collection. Very well. Mr. Cohen awaits your participation at his performance. So who is this fellow Cohen? Some sort of underworld figure? Worse. He's an artist. An artist who kidnaps children? Cohen's muse is a bit more diverse. I've seen this type. Gets an idea in his head, end a conversation. Don't matter who gets hurt. One's a real biscuit. Isn't he a biscuit, lady? Let me ask a few questions. Questions? Yes. Yes. It is the work of man to ask. It is the work of the artist to answer. You've seen this girl, haven't you? We artists see more than most. 
You are more than you claim to be, little songbird. Are you not? Watch this one, DeWitt. She'll take you where you don't want to go. But I know the child in that photo is important to you. So many children flit, flit, flit away. I know where the girl is. And I will send you to her in exchange. All I ask is a dance. What? I see something in you too. Art strips away artifice. Show me who you are, and I will show you where you need to go. Son of a bitch. Mr. DeWitt. Dance with me. I shudder to think what greater price he might care to extract. Fitzpatrick! Beauty and pain. They can be no more separated than birth and blood. What do you think Cohen's customers do with the children? Do they? Sometimes. But those types like the capital of people like Ryan and Suchon. That's a blessing. You saw those little sisters? You so sure? But if Suchon had Sally, I'd know it. How? As I tied him to a chair and asked him. So? For 15 hours. I don't know what to make of you, Mr. DeWitt. No, 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 no! Listen, we're not gonna keep- Fitzpatrick! I see suffering in you. I know how to shine a light on your pain. Mr. DeWitt, are you all right? I'm fine. You were dreaming. You kept saying your daughter's name, Sally. She's not my daughter. I thought... Pain and beauty. To an artist, they are parent and child. Cohen? I'm sending you to find your young one. <laughs> no need to thank me. I'm not so sure you'll like what you find. Look. Fontaine's. Ryan sent the whole thing to the bottom. But it's a prison now. Why would Cohen have sent Sally there? I don't know. Everyone has needs. I merely provide a service for those who have the means to pay. You'll find your little bird in the housewares department. How many people do you suppose Ryan's got locked up in that place? Enough. Fontaine had amassed something near an army. Now they're down there, spliced up and wild. All right, there's a dock up ahead. It takes a cold son of a bitch to do that to a living person. What's that? Burial at sea. You read your residency contract with Ryan Industries? In perpetuity, we're all buried at sea. Comfortable. Keep your eyes open. Seem to be some supplies this way, Mr. Dewitt. It's Booker. What? Just call me Booker. If it's all the same to you. Let's leave it at Mr. Dewitt.
Look up there. Let's have another look around. Perhaps we'll be able to find something to get us up and over. Could be handy. A skyhook? Skyhook? You mean the air grabber? Kids use them to ride around up on the new mow lines. Air grabber? Huh. Constants and variables. Constants and what? Never mind. Mr. DeWitt, someone's no, coming. No, no. Come back. I want the frost. I could lose my job. All right, I got the grabber unjammed. Just a new agent. I may. Mr. DeWitt, look. Housewares. That's where Cohen said we'd find Sally. The store ran trams between the three buildings. We'll need to avail ourselves of that. Assuming it still works. Optimism, Mr. DeWitt. It helps in situations like this. <laughs> Hey, I don't care for all that splicing. 
When did you come to Rapture? Oh, it was, uh, geez, I guess around 51? No, 48? That's a rather large gap. Time. Life I had before sort of becomes a blur. 49. 49 for sure. Damn. You look a mess, Mr. DeWitt. Just keep your eyes open for splicers. They can do us a whole lot worse. Here, little birdies. Eat it up. Well, it, it's good for you, you know? I've never heard of birds that didn't like seeds. What's, what's the matter with you? Do, do you think it's poison? Splicer had no problem freezing a path for himself before. I'm sure he'll be happy to do the same for us. I have no doubt you'll prove persuasive. sunk a few hundred feet beyond its specifications. More pressure, more burst pipes. Mr. DeWitt, look. An ice ring. Be good at places any to look for our new friend. Says it's on the top floor. So we go up. Damn thing's locked. Let me see that. Oh, have matters progressed so little? I could turn this with a rake pick. Done. Where'd you learn that? Oh, it's something I picked up a long time ago. Yeah, our frozen friend leaves a hell of a trail.
spit, Frankie. Baby. And you leave me what? Try ducking. Don't make me. I raise you up. I've got lots to do, and, and, and little time to do it. Stay away from me. Parasite, this. 
And the exaltation of man, that's sure, it could all get a bit of a bore. But the old bear sure knew how to enunciate. Locking up, it must be good.
I've been on something of a hiatus. play, the Herald said, a dead whale has washed up at the Schubert Theater and stinks a little more with each passing. <laughs> the Tribune called my first opera as having the effect of canceling out all of Mozart's classics in a single caterwaul. And now, critics take me to task for my humanitarian work. If I were not there, to find a home for these orphans, would these belly acres take my place? <laughs> An artist once said, All critics should be assassinated. I just might take him up on that. What's happened to these people? They don't even seem sane. Nothing beats her first surprise. From there, it's all downhill. The frozen frosties. The jockeys will hand you a thousand volts as soon as look at you. You sound sympathetic. They will be the first sons of bitches who found an answer at the bottom of a bottle. But once you see them go all weak at the knees at the sight of a little sister and all her Adam, they cut a less sympathetic figure. Circuited. Probably be able to pop it open with it. A jolt of shock jockey? You familiar with shock jockey? More than you could know. Let's look around. Maybe there's a store ain't been ransacked by splicers yet.
lock needs picking. That little old lock. diaries and the pneuma tubes like a message in a goddamn bottle hoping one will get through and someone will save me if you get this send help i'm holed up in the shoe storeroom the code's 0928 diaries and the pneuma tubes like a message in a goddamn bottle hoping one will get through and someone will save me if you get this send help i'm holed up in the shoe storeroom the code 0928 
Harkness. That's what this town is. All my audio diaries, begging for rescue, came back on red. Marked, return to sender, insufficient postage. Best advice. Uh -huh.
Of my first play, the Herald said, a dead whale has washed up Short the circuit. Schubert Theater. Probably be able to pop it open with it. A jolt of shock jockey? You familiar with shock jockey? More than you could know. Well, let's look around. Maybe there's a store ain't been ransacked by splicers yet. In a single caterwaul. And now, critics take me to task for my humanitarian work. If I were not there to find a home for these orphans, would these belly acres take my place? An artist once said, All critics should be assassinated. I just might take him up on that. Together, we'll reap it! something you Ryan lock up all of Fontaine's followers in a department. It's locked. He needed somewhere to put Fontaine's button in. Why not shut down the competition in the bargain? But I thought Andrew Ryan was all about free markets and open competition. All those ideas lose their luster when the quarterly earnings come in and you find the other guys eating your lunch. Either way, Fontaine's dead. by your
Something tells me all that cold isn't just coming from the ice rink. I say so. You got it. Anyone comes near that bottle without permission is a dead man. Mr. DeWitt, the plasmid? Have you forgotten what we came for? Can you unlock this? Drink every last bottle of Old Man Winter. I think I can help. <gasps> what was that? It's a uh, new plasmid. Let's me, let's me bring in things that might exist, but uh, don't. I'm not sure I understand. What's it called? Tear. Where'd you find that? You don't expect a girl to share all her secrets, do you, Mr. Dewitt? Freeze your enemies. Shatter them into a thousand pieces.
know you're the client and all, but I've gone about far enough without a few answers. My purpose here is none of your concern. Consider me a means to an end. And why do I get the feeling I'm being set up? I told you I'm in collections. An account is in arrears. My clients simply want to see matters set to right. Don't make any sense, that's all. If you don't like the arrangement, the bathosphere's back that way. Ray Fontaine called me in the other day. Me, Ray Lorne. Oh, Says trouble's coming and he's passing out special plasmids to all his Stop. best guys. I mean, it, it, it's an honor, but man, I started getting these shingles all over. Skin's discolored. Like when a guy's about to lose a limb, you know? And I can't seem to pile on enough clothes. I hate to ask, but is this happening to everybody?
完的。啊啊
left me with nothing! Sally's not your daughter. What's she to you? Why risk life and limb? It's part of the job. You owe me no explanation. She's just another orphan. After Fontaine went down, city was lousy. And? I don't know. Do you have a reason for every stupid thing you've ever done? You started showing up. Looking peaked. Fool me to feed the brat. Should have known she would have never leave. How did you know? It's none of your business.
about you. It doesn't sit right. Yes? Wouldn't peg you as the rapture type. Not even a little. If you mean I have no interest in joining the Andrew Ryan book club, you'd be right. Just another set of fanatics with a different set of books. I gamble. What? You asked me how I lost Sally. I gamble. Took her somewhere a kid's got no business being. I was winning. A place like that. You don't let a kid out of your sight. But you did. Yeah, and here we are. But the million dollar question is, what's she to you? I have an interest in reuniting you with her. Isn't that reason enough? Let's hope Cohen was on the level when he said this is where we'd find Sally. I can only imagine what they would do with a child in a place like this. Cohen's halfway to Splice Town. Probably thought putting a child in prison would be high art. The sooner we find her, the better. Come on out! Sally! Do it! Sally! Come out of there! I can't see her. What are you doing? This is a schematic for the venting system. It shows there are more vents like this one in electronics, the bistro, returns, the book department, and the appliance show floor. So? If she's in there, there are only six vents she can come out of. Now there are five. All these vents are connected to the central heating unit. If we close them off and turn the heat up, she'll be forced out through the central exhaust. The only exit. You want to burn her alive? No, we just make it hot enough to flush her out. You can't do that. Look, either we find her, or one of those splicers will. All right. Where are the other vents? Up ahead. Take long at all. Ready. Come on, love. Oh, Mickey just wants to give you a little squeeze. <laughs> you don't. Found anything? That over there. Down. Where to now?
got hold of that damn radar range last night. Started trying it out on everything. Apples, marshmallows, spoons. Had himself a fine time until our peak at ease stepped in the way. And for some reason, I'm the one in touch with the wife. Well, I locked the damn thing up. Oh, uh... Forget the code, it's 3958. Have another future, oh, sorry. Huh? I've been in the yeah, weeds this entire shift. got hold of that damn radar range last night. Started oh, trying it out on everything. It's just terrific, all oh, the two of you. Marshmallows, spoons. Had himself a fine time until our peak at ease stepped in the way. And for some reason, I'm the one in touch with the wife. Well, I locked the damn thing up. Oh, uh... So don't forget the code, it's 3958. It's a radar range. Never could figure out if the thing's designed to cook a turkey or a splicer. Damn, Tor's got a key code lock. No way to get in without knowing what it is. Ruined.
It's done. Do it. All right. Now. On it. Elizabeth. I'll see what I can do. Uh, isn't everything just a woman? All yours. The food, the band. Even your parents are behaving. <laughs> uh, really? <laughs> I tried so hard to reduce to fit into this gown. Well, I, I just wanted to look beautiful for you. Corner, like I did as a child. Careless. Not a single thought to where an accident might leave us. Well, Dr. Wortham prescribed a plasmid. A mother's no, little... is dangerous. Just insane. Next time, I'll be sure to ask. I let my guard down for a second. That boy may get himself killed.
Sally? Sally, it's me, Booker. Now, you come out now. S Sally? Dear, do, do you hear me? It's, it's me, Booker. Now listen, dear. You come out right now! Mr. DeWitt, she's not coming. Now let's get the rest of these vents sealed. It's the only way. It's the last one. Where's the exhaust? In the toy department. Got a lock here. Gee, the government sure does like to tell people what to do. Exactly. All done. Nico time. Because I'm But I'm a mess. I'm a mess. I heard you. This. Will not be easy! Ammo! Ethan? Much obliged! Ethan! Much obliged! What's taking so long? I, just, I can't get this. Come on! I'm just, I'm trying, just give me a second.
All right, let me go check the exhaust vent. Sign of her. Looks like we'll need to turn up the thermostat if we're gonna flush her out. It's over that way. <laughs> to bring her to us. If you won't do it, I will. Just give me the word. Turn it up. What? Turn the goddamn thermostat up. Uh. Ah! Did you hear that? We need to get back to the exhaust before we lose the girl again. It isn't working. I told you she's it isn't working. Turn it off. We have to turn it off. We are hurting her. Sally! Sally? Sally, it's Booker. It's me. Sally, come on. I'm gonna get you out of here. Sally! Come out here right now. No. Sally! 
Come to see you. We're going home. Do you want to go home? Don't. Please. Don't. I'm here. I just want to take you home. I just want to. You're hurting her. She's not your child. She is mine. Let her go. Let her go. She's mine. Close it. Shut it down. Shut down the machine. Shut down the machine. She's I remember all of it. That poor child. She wasn't yours, Comstock. Oh, no. I wasn't. No, no, no. Yet you had to have me, didn't you? No, this isn't right. And when the guilt no. was too much... You turned to us to solve your problem. To provide a place to go where you might forget. Where there never was an Anna in the first place. Comstock was never one to own up to his errors. Someone else's life to claim is his own. Elizabeth, child, I am so sorry. No, you're not. But you're about to be. Oh. 